Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of this friendly. Today it's Barcelona against Bayern Munich. Let's head straight for the Camp Nou, the floodlights shining down in the heart of Barcelona. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. We welcome you to this friendly fixture today. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith is with me. And we are looking forward to seeing what this game brings us. Well, it radiates European history, doesn't it? It's a wonderful fixture for us. We're lucky to be here, Alan. Bayern against Barca. Yep, as soon as this draw came out, I've been looking forward to the tie. And uh, I don't think we're going to be disappointed with the football on show here. Barcelona's lineup here. Claudio Bravo starts in goal. Gerard Piquet starts with Javier Mascherano as the centre-backs. Iniesta plays with Xavi in the centre of the park. Luis Suarez is the lone striker today. Bayern Munich's lineup. Manuel Neuer starts in goal. Mehdi Benasche starts with Jerome Boateng in central defence. Ian Robin starts with Frank Ribéry looking to provide width. Robert Lewandowski is the main striker today. Well, for Pep Guardiola, his first season with Bayern Munich, he couldn't do the treble, but he did do the domestic double. Well, is that failure? Is it success? I don't know. The standards are set so high in Munich. And uh, for Pep Guardiola, he slightly changed the style of play, but uh, he got a, a rude awakening in that semi-final, didn't he, against Real Madrid? And the man who is going to referee the game today, Gavin Mansfield. Bayern Munich getting us underway at the start of the first half. Jordi Alba. Piquet. Daniel Alves. Jordi Alba. Sergio Busquets. And it's come to Xavi. Here's the chance. That's the keeper's athleticism there to make that save corner now for Barcelona how to improve on perfection that was the problem for Bayern Munich in 2013-14 when you've won the lot the year before it's difficult isn't it Alan? It is difficult as Pep Guardiola found out and uh, he obviously changed their style of football slightly and it looked at one stage as if he was going to perform the impossible and well emulate the treble at least that they achieved on the Heinkers but uh, wasn't to be this looks dangerous from Messi a week he's that good well he is we've grown accustomed to watching this working in such a tight space you just cannot get the ball off him and the score is one nil Robert Lewandowski Challenged by the opponent. Iniesta. It's the thing about football, it does move on. Iniesta and his Spanish colleagues, of course, have had so many great. It's a quick break. In with the chance. Goalkeeper able to reach up and deal with that. He was trying to be cheeky. Well, there was a chance, but he uh, it had to be perfect, and it wasn't quite. Daniel Alves. Sergio Busquets. Luis Suarez. The 
defender has to be quick. Defender's done very well to clear that. Throwing for Bayern Munich. That's very well read, and that's a very good interception. Ian Robin. Barcelona have given away this free kick. from Robert and I wonder about the keeper but there was good power on that header and that's a goal well worth analyzing again well we're back at level pegging again at 1-1 Mascherano seems to have got better with age Javier Mascherano and certainly playing for Barcelona has sharpened his game back in midfield for his country and very good the master of midfield really for Argentina that will be a free kick against Barcelona Frank Ribéry Bayern Munich so used to winning today if they do I think they're going to be Somewhere approaching their best against what is a really strong outfit. Luis Suarez. This could be it. In the clear here. Here's the chance. And he does his job fantastically well. You know, he's got such stature. He doesn't believe he's going to get beaten in those one-on-ones, this keeper. Changes. There's always places for headed clearances like that. He's gone for goal. And it's gone all the way through to the goalkeeper. <laughs> Ian Robert. It's messy. Neymar, Sergio Busquets. Javier Mascherano, Iniesta. Made the challenge well. Schweinsteiger. Showing it's a physical game when it's a fair one. So here we are at half time and it's 1 1. And look at that half time scoreline. It totally doesn't reflect the balance of the match and the territorial domination that one team's had. Uh, that's true. I mean, the, the lesser of the two sides have got out of jail, haven't they, with uh, the amount of chances that they can. So here we go with the second half. PK. Towards Chavi. He takes the shot. The keeper really stretched and he's made a fine diving save. We've got a chance now and we want to have another look at Robin's goal. Well, straight off the meat of the forehead and that's flown into the right-hand side of the goal. to Chavi. Suarez! Well, get the shot out, it's still in play. Fast line to get the throw. Five minutes. I'm making a change now. Iniesta. Luis Suarez. Goodness, they needed him then to clear that. 
One shot, one on target for Bayern Munich. Yeah, there's been nothing wrong with the finishing. His goalkeeper extremely busy here. Looking at the bench, it's Bayern who are making the move with the substitute. Neymar. In with a chance. The keeper caught out there. He reached it but couldn't keep it out. Wonderful, wonderful technique to just feather it into the bottom right. Let's have another peek at that goal. <laughs> and the scoreline is 2 1. Mario Goetze. Feel good about that. A really strong and clean tackle. Javi Alonso. It's messy. Busquets. That passing is top class. Neymar. Good challenge here. Chance for it. Got to be. I don't know what part of the ball he connected with, but it wasn't the right part, was it? It was. He sliced it, he skewed it, whatever it was. He didn't hit the centre of that ball. Great tackling technique. To win the ball cleanly. Iniesta. Good strong challenge. And it goes for goal. A decent effort. Just just off target. Yeah, unlucky because uh, he got some power behind the ball, just not the direction. It's lovely to see that kind of finish. Not an easy one by any means. He's got a lot of work to do to beat the keeper, but he does it with wonderful accuracy. Neymar. Sergio Busquets, and now offside, Luis Suarez. Under challenge, that's good control. Bayern Munich trying to do something very late in the game. I think this is going to be kitchen sink time, Martin, now. Plenty of long balls into the box, trying to get on those knockdowns. Lionel Messi. Philip Lahm. And it's taken the touch from the player to go over the line. They've got a corner now by a minute, even though they are a goal behind. This is quite significant, maybe. What a good piece of defensive clearance that was. Lionel Messi. This could be it. Here's the chance. He scored. The goal for Messi. He won't have scored too many better than that. He certainly won't have hit too many harder than he did there. And here's the goal again. towards Messi and now Messi brilliant opening Thank 
5 minutos de tiempo suplementario. David Alaba. Medi Benatia. They've got the ball back through a very good interception. This could be a chance. Messi in the clear. In with a chance. And he's put it away beautifully. A goal for Neymar. Well, I've missed a few of these in my time. It isn't as easy as it looks. But he made it look easy then, I've got to say. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Well, they're a top team, and the scoreline absolutely shows that. And now, Iniesta. Barcelona have done it. There is the final whistle. They've won this game. You don't often get such a one-sided match at this level of the game, but that's what we've seen, Alan. Well, we have, and uh, credit to the players out there for playing so well and for dominating it right from start to finish.